Do you have any siding corner pieces like this? It's a darn shame. That's really ugly. Grass cutters and the weed whackers, they get in here and they just crack that vinyl to heck. This actually is a difficult problem because these vinyl corner pieces go on first to the structure before the siding. So you would have to literally rip everything off and replace it. Okay, I'm gonna show you what I think is a permanent solution that's gonna protect the wood structure underneath, will stop the mice and any kind of small burrowing animals from getting underneath here. When I was thinking about this problem, I was like, well, if we rip off the siding by a brand new vinyl corner piece, what's gonna stop this from happening again? It's going to happen again, guaranteed. So I thought metal, let's put metal on here as a permanent repair so it will last longer and not uh, get damaged from weed whackers. Now check the video description down below. I'll show you a couple different options of aluminum flashing. So I found this in the home improvement aisle on the metal flashing area. So you're at the coil, metal stock, roofing, flashing, that kind of area. In bulk, these are less than a dollar each, preformed aluminum reinforced step flashing. So my theory was, what if we take something like this and we adhere it over the damage? Now, of course, it's not a color match, but I think it actually looks pretty sharp and that will stand up to the weed whackers and prevent future damage. Now to adhere this, you don't need anything crazy like nailing right through the surface. I thought that'd be too aggressive. Let's just use contact adhesive. Okay, this is a multi-purpose contact adhesive. So the manufacturer's instructions are to apply it to both sides of the product. So that's the broken corner piece and the aluminum flashing. This corner piece used to go all the way down to the near the ground. So let's cut a piece to try to slip it underneath. Don't need to get too fancy here. We'll just use 10 snips. Okay, let's see if I can do a dry fit. Okay, I'm gonna get out the uh, contact adhesive and see if I can get that to, to stick. You're actually gonna let each side dry. The manufacturer recommends up to two minutes. So it's actually gonna begin like a curing process. And that's up in here as well. And this will be covered up by the second piece. Okay, we've made contact. This will continue to cure for 24 to 48 hours per the manufacturer's instructions. Um, I will probably come back with some clear silicone and hit any areas where I think a little crawlies or insects will get in there. But we've done a good job as far as the corner piece is strong now. We don't have the holes anymore. That should stand up and be resistant to the future weed whackers. Let me know if you have any cracked corner pieces and what you've decided to do with it. A brand new replacement corner piece probably is at least a $50 piece. And then you have to undo all of the siding adjacent to it. It's a major undertaking. This looks like a quick, easy fix. Hey, I know you can do it yourself.